Hello, this show is from Milwaukee to Nashville. We are brought to you by the wonderful folks at Hockey Walker, 2002 West Howard Avenue, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. You can call them at 414-800-7585. As you can see, our set's set to orange. And much like all of Canada and the hockey world was shaken by the news a couple days ago that they found... uh, 215 children buried under a residential school in Kamloops, British Columbia in Canada. Um, I think they need to look into more of them in, in indigenous areas, uh, particularly. Um, it'll just show that what, how it was. It, it, and and it, because we all know, they're just not looking because they don't want it out. I've been right. right here. Um, there was a lot of genocide, and and it was really bad. And um, you know, this is something that shakes hard. Yeah. Because um, and our thoughts are with the Camelot Blazers, um, and their organization of uh, I believe they are in the uh, Western Hockey League, if I remember correctly. Here. Well, I guess I'm right. I guess. Eh, we we looked up and made sure, and uh, you know, this is the real thing. You know, there's a lot of things that have been happening more frequently. Much yeah. like we said earlier, our thoughts were with. LA and with Montreal with what happened tonight tonight as we record this and with you know with Kamloops and and all of British Columbia this needs to stop yeah it needs to stop these things need to stop it's not like this anymore why can't we all get along why does this stuff need to happen nobody's different Peel back a layer of skin, we all bleed the same color. Right. We all come into this world with nothing. We all leave this world with nothing. You know, and 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 I know that's a bleak, sad look at life. We gotta enjoy what we have while we have it. Right. And things like this make it very hard. Because I feel that the, I feel bad that these kids never got to enjoy our what we got to enjoy. Right. The lie. These are children. I'm not talking grown adults. If it was grown adults, nobody bad at eye. People would be mad for a few weeks. But this is something that's going to sting for a long time. Yeah. And it's not right. No. Nope. And you know, looking at it. Um, CNN made a report on it, and uh, this school was known to the camp. It was the Camelops Indian Residential School. Children as young as three. And they said that this was roughly dated back to 1960s. Right. That should have never happened in the 60s. No. How is this not found? Right. How is this never spoken, never documented? Where are the parents? Were they that scared? No, I mean, and we have, you know, had some um, really good hockey players come out of that area. Yeah. What if one of those was, you know, the next Wayne Gretzky, the next greatest hockey player ever, but they never got to live their life. You know, here's the thing. Nobody knows. This school 
was one of the largest schools in Canada operated since the late 19th century into the 70s. And then it was taken over by a Catholic church until the federal government took it over in the 60s. I mean, it's really sad that, you know, this was never taken care of, never done. This is horrifying. And, and it shows that, you know, at this point in time, and, and, and in looking at all of this, you know, the, I'll, as a parent, it, it really irks my soul. Yeah. It hurts really hard. It, you know, my prayers are with the remaining family members. And my, I, I don't even know what to say. I don't want to cry on camera, but I'm fighting it, as me and John both are. This, this yet again, you know, we've had a rough set of shows tonight. Yeah. And, you know, um, I, I, can, I, I give credit to the NHL teams that have done stuff for this to all the teams in Canada, to all the teams in America who have stepped up and said something. Right. I give credit to those of you that remain silent. In this, these are kids. We're not talking about grown adults. Right. They can speak for themselves. Their family can speak for them. In this case, these are kids. No one will ever know what right. happened. And this is not, this, this is something we cannot stay silent on anymore. As they've always said, the children are our future. Right. Let's make it as easy for them as possible. What if, and I'm just saying, what if you ever really thought of, you know, think of it this way. If, the, if us Americans think we treated the Indians then and what happened here, and we have talked about that in the past in, in our in our society, and it is really bad. But this is worse than anything we hear about in our news, and our yeah. our and what we've done. And and, and it surprises me, and it hurts, and as we. We've said we don't understand. We will never understand it. It's just something I can't. But, right. um, in our case, our best option here is uh, we're going to give a moment of silence for all these kids. And um, we will see you guys this weekend. Thank you all for watching and thank you all for being there. Yeah. Please give us a thumbs up on this video and watch our other content. Much better content that but you know, much more upbeat content. Yeah. Yes. So we hope for better content soon. We got more coming for you guys soon. So we'll see you soon. From Milwaukee to Nashville. Out.